Hello, my name is Steven, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to integrate your autoresponder program with your ClickFunnels program. Now the example we're going to be using for this particular video is the Get Response Autoresponder. I've already logged in, and when I when you usually log in, you go to your dashboard page, which is where I'm at now. And so we're going to start here in getting the integrating done for our ClickFunnels account. The first thing we want to do is click on the Contacts tab, and then we want to create a list. So once we are in our Contact List page, we'll click Create List. And I'm going to just use an example list here. Uh, I've already got my list created as to what I'm going to be using, but for the purposes of showing you how to do this, I'll just simply create a list. So we'll call it tab, tab list. So what I've done is um, in creating this list, all your letters have to be lowercase. And if you're going to use more than one word, you want to connect it with another score. And then you can simply create the list by hitting the create button. and your list will appear. Now, in some cases, it may not always appear on your contact list page, so all you simply have to do is to refresh and the list will appear. So I'm going to delete this list because the contact name I'm going to be connecting to the autoresponder, or rather the, um, the funnel that I'm going to be using for this campaign, is this ClickFunnel affiliate here. So for right now, if I want to delete this, I will simply go across to these marks here, hover over them, and I will come over to my list and down to my delete. And you'll notice it'll say, please confirm that you want to delete the tab list list. And yes, I do want to do that. And there we have it deleted. And it lets us know it's deleted. And so that's just something added if you ever want to delete a list. Now that we've gotten our list name um, done in our autoresponder, we're now going to go to our ClickFunnels account so that we can integrate the autoresponder with ClickFunnels. And in integrating the autoresponder with ClickFunnels, we're going to be integrating it with this particular list so that our email opt-ins will go under this particular category here. So that is the reason why this had to be created first. So now we're going to go over to ClickFunnels. And I've already opted in here as well. And this is my dashboard page. And so in order to get to the funnel that we want to use for this particular demonstration, um, we'll hover over the ClickFunnel tab. And then we'll go down to the Browse Funnels. And then we'll click there. And to the left of our page, all of our listings of our funnel should appear. This is the funnel that I'm going to be using. This is also the funnel that you will be given for free. I'm going to click on the funnel here. <clears throat> so when you click on your funnel, all your pages appear. There's a column that will list your pages. They appear one at a time as you click on them. Now this funnel has two pages. Mine is set up a little bit differently, but your funnel will have a page here and a page underneath. And your second page will be your thank you page. My thank you page is in this category here and if I were to click on thank you page then it would simply appear right here. And this is the thank you page. Well we're going to be focusing on the opt-in page because that's the page that we're going to use for the integration. That is the page that your traffic will see for the very first time. And that is the page that your traffic will put in their name and email um, addresses as well. So that is your opt-in page. So that is the page we want to integrate with. To do that, we're going to click on Edit Page. And we will go to our Page Editor. <clears throat> and this, of course, is that first page that I was talking about. So we're going to 
hover over settings and we're going to go down to integrations because we want to integrate the autoresponder with ClickFunnels. We'll click on integration and to the right will pop up a, a box and this is where we're going to be integrating our autoresponder with ClickFunnels. So the first subject we come to is integration so we click down the down and the drop down and since we're using get response that's going to be the autoresponder I'll be clicking on. There are other autoresponders you can place in here as well but for the purpose of this example we're going to be using get response. So I've clicked get response and you can see it appears here. Now we're going to be taking the action and our action is going to be adding a campaign. And this, of course, is the list of campaigns. And this actually connects with the list on that contact list page that is in the autoresponder. So this is what this is connecting with. So the one I was going to use was ClickFunnels Affiliate. So I'm going to click on that one. And as you can see, it does appear. Now, let me say something. When you do this for the first time, when you set up your page, your, when you create your list, your contact list for the very first time, and you get it on your contact list page, when you go to ClickFunnels and you go to the integration section, when you are looking to add your list to this section here, it may not appear here. So what you would have to do is refresh this page and then click here again and your list name will appear. So that's how, so if you find that you don't find the name, don't do not panic, just simply refresh the list and it will appear. Now that we've gotten this information in place, we want to click in the open space, push save, and then we're done. So just to double check, we'll go out of this page and we're going to come back into the page and then you'll see that the integration has been put in place. So let me go to our edit page again. So our page editor comes up, and then I'm going to go to settings. And as you can see, the green check mark is here, showing that the integration is in place. So it was saved. But I'm going to click on it. <clears throat> I'm going to click on the integration. I don't know why it didn't come up then. As you can see, I get responses here. Add campaign is here and click funnel affiliate is there. So this is how you integrate your autoresponder to your ClickFunnels account. If you have any other questions, you can simply just in as you look into your funnel, you can go down to the bottom of the page and you will see me listed on Facebook and you can just simply um, send me a message and I'll be more than happy to answer it.